What's up, Internet? Lucky here, playing some crank on Black Hawk, War Hawk. Yeah, um, I'm a fucking time master. I was I was on COD Ghost, and then I was on Modern uh, Warfare One, and now I'm back on COD Ghost because I figured, you know, you guys you guys need need your ghost fix. You guys need to stay current, and uh, Modern Warfare One was for me. That, that's that's my thing. I just needed to get away. Get on to Modern Warfare 1, you know, just just a cleanse. I needed a cleanse. Um, just due to some of the irritations in COD Ghost, I just needed to feel right again. And so, it took me a little break. Hopped on some uh, Modern Warfare 1. Me and Ace tore things up. You should check out that video. Like, well, not as much as I should have, but still, every now and then I have to go back. I have to jump back into it. Modern Warfare 1, just because uh, it was just such a fun game. But yeah, now I'm back on Ghost, and what's up, dude? Um, now I'm back on Ghost, playing some of this. I do like the new game mode, I forget what it's called, Extinction? Extin I don't know. Whatever it's called, where you have more health. That mode's fucking awesome, and that'll, that will probably be what I play from now on. Most of my games will be that, I'm betting. And I know you're here. I know you were coming. And you, I know, I, I fucking see you. I see fucking everything. No blind spots. Yeah. So playing that, it's been rough. I just needed, I just needed some me time. I just needed that break. It's, it's been rough. It's been cold as shit. Fucking my workplace is fucking freezing. Like we have this bay door, and the. Uh, the freaking, you know, guys are going through in and out, and it just blows frigid, cold air into that motherfucker. And I'm right there in front of it. Lucky me. Ha, ironically. Um, freaking it blows right up on me. But, uh, so, you, it's just freezing, like, it's not running down your nose, and it just forming icicles. It's like we're working in a refrigerator. Yeah, I've been dealing with that. It's fucking shrunk my bladder down to the size of a peanut. Just all shriveled up, so I have to fucking go piss like every two seconds. Even if I didn't have anything to drink. And, um... Uh, stupid. Like, during one of these, these, these piss sessions, if you will, I, uh... Dude comes up behind me and shit, and they do this often at work. And it's just annoying. Like, I don't know what it is about these people. But they just don't know the rules. They don't know the rules. Like this dude, I'm, I'm fucking like dick out in the urinal, you know, splashing away. And uh, this dude freaking comes up behind me and starts talking to me. It's just like, hey man, how's it going? What's going on? You doing, you doing all right? And I'm like, dude, my dick's out, man. Don't, don't fucking talk to me. There's an unwritten rule that states if, if you're a dude, don't talk to me while my dick's out. It's just, it's just an unwritten rule that everyone is pretty... Most people are aware of, or should be. You don't talk to people while their dick's out. You know? Just, just don't. If you're a chick, the only thing I want to hear is... Mm, 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 the sound of you sucking it. Like, those, those are the... That's the only almost exception. Even then, I don't really want to hear talking. But, uh, yeah, this dude just completely ignores the rule. And I, I'm not one, I'm a person who just hates small talk altogether. I fucking can't stand small talk. When somebody comes up and they're just freaking like, hey man, how's it going? Nice weather we're having and shit like that. Don't, I don't give a fuck. Shut up. And, ooh, that was convenient. Dude just ran right out in front of me. Like, I don't give a fuck, man. Shut that shit up. Like, don't, don't. Uh, like, don't say useless things to me. If you're gonna tell me something, it needs to be funny or relevant or interesting or something like that. Like, I'm not saying that I kill people if they, you know, say something that, you know, I'm not interested in. I'm not saying that you can't say anything, but I do kill people for that. Ooh, catch that knife. God, I'm on it. I am on it. Um,. Freaking, I'm just saying that, like, my girlfriend, I have to tell her this all the time. She'll be telling me a story 
about some like just something that happened during her day and stuff and it's it's nothing big or major or whatever like she'll just be like oh oh, oh my uh, like omg like my cousin came down and i never get to see her and we hung out and it was just fun like we went to the mall and we went shopping and and like we like went to see a movie and it was like like this guy is it, it like this girl thinks he's bad but he's not that bad he's just misunderstood and, and, and so it takes a while for her to find like see his true self and his soul like and she's just she becomes in love with his soul and and he's just not not that bad of a guy and, and i'm just like babe 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 i don't give a fuck there's only there's only one thing i need to know about this story is your cousin fucking hot or not? That's it. That's all I need to know. Just get to the point. Just get to the point of things and let's move on. You know, like, I just tell me, you know, hit me with the bangs. Hit me with the booms. Like, this happened and this happened. And that's what was interesting. Story done. That's all I need. You know, but I don't know. That's just, that's just me and, and the people that I'm around. That's just how we do things. I mean, I just... I, I hate small talk. I hate when people talk, like, and I just know that we're going to have nothing to talk about. I, I can't stand talking to people like that. So, I mean, but message, moral of the story is, guys, if, if, if a guy has his dick out, don't talk to him. Like, unless you're gay, I guess. But even then, it's kind of like, nah, just keep it kind of quiet. Don't, don't, don't say a lot. Just don't say a lot when people's fucking genitalia are out. All right. Unless it's a party, though. But I will see you guys later. That wraps this video up. Lucky out. Peace. Sorry. I'm just so, I'm just so hyped right now. This is, this, is, this is the pinnacle of gaming right here. It's a classic. He's throwing nades like he's going out of style. Like this game's going out of style.